How's it going everyone? Chris here and welcome to my Blu-ray update and today we're going to take a look at a brand new release by Arrow Video US which is a set of three films and that is Takashi Miike's Dead or Alive. So Takashi Miike is a filmmaker from Japan and he got started back in uh, 1991 and his films tend to be very controversial for its style and you know he's not that typical type of director you'll come to expect from Japan because you know the Japanese people are very conservative but uh, Takashi Miike's style of movies I would somewhat compare it to uh, Quentin Tarantino you know, because they're extremely violent and uh, has lots of, you know, graphic content, nudity, bloodshed. So that's one thing I highly respect about Takashi's films, you know. Um, he wanted to be different. He didn't want to be the typical type of director making the same type of boring films. And uh, he wanted to come out of that bubble and uh, make something different. His style is really out there, man. He uses really great camera angles, uh, lots of different colors, you know. Cinematography is absolutely fantastic. And he was way ahead of his time you know, in his films. So in this set, you get, of course, you know, as I mentioned, three films. You get Dead or Alive, as well as Dead or Alive 2, Birds, and uh, Dead or Alive Final. So Takashi is now considered to be one of the highly respected directors in the business, and uh, so much so that he was actually invited to direct an episode of the uh, Masters of Horror anthology. And uh, of course, you know, that uh, anthology series uh, had a number of other great uh, famous directors like John Carpenter and uh, Toby Hooper. So this set of films is about the uh, Japanese mafia going up against the Chinese immigrant gangsters. And like I said, uh, lots of nudity. And uh, man, something about these Asian women, they really love to let loose. And, you know, of course, us guys, we love to watch them. And, you know, violence, bloodshed, lots of fun stuff, man. If you guys haven't heard about the series yet, uh, trust me, you guys are going to have a really fun time with these set of films. So these three films were made between 1999 and uh, 2002. And... As far as my thoughts on the picture and audio quality, you know, the transfers look decent. They're not great. They're not horrible. It's in the middle. I'm going to rate all three films a three and a half out of a five. You know, grain is intact, but the image itself uh, has a rather soft looking picture to it. But uh, you get a slight pop here and there. But like I said, it's just a rather soft looking picture. But the audio mix, I'm going to rate that a four out of a five for all three films. And all three movies are presented in the 1.85 aspect ratio. And this set also contains a few special features, so uh, let's get on with the unboxing and I'll show you what's included. 